Okay, so welcome back to Precalculus. We just have one bell work today. Um, Emerson can dig two holes in three hours. Okay, so we'll say uh, the rate of Emerson is uh, two holes in three hours. Also known as uh, 0 0.67. Mm, do I really want to do that? I don't know. I, I don't think maybe I want to do that. I was going to do that, but I don't think I will. Um, and Joanna, or, no, there's it's just Jonah. Jonah? Jonah? Who spells Jonah like that? Anyway, uh, the rate of Jonah is uh, three holes in two hours. Okay, six holes need to be dug. If Emerson digs for one hour and then is joined by Jonah, how long will they work together to finish digging the six holes? All right, now let's see here. Um, all right, so we know there's a time. There's some time. I don't know what it is. Uh, well, the I guess I know the first time. Time, I'm going to say the rate. Okay, let me, let me say this first. Um, the holes are going to be equal to... Uh, the rate, or the rates, times the time, right? Okay, this is analogous to distance is equal to the rate times time, okay? So, um, anyway, um, if we say, for instance, um, as an example, if we said holes were equal to, we'll say, uh, three holes per hour, somebody's really fast here, and, uh, and they work for two hours, hours, boy that's beautiful, beautiful work there. Uh, they work for two hours, the hours are going to cancel and I'm going to be left with holes, three times two is six holes. So if it was just one rate I'd know it would take um, two hours if somebody dig, dug that fast, which nobody's digging that fast. Apparently these are big holes. So, anyway, um, what we're going to do here is we're going to lay it out like this. We're going to say, we know that there has to be six holes. Okay, so that's not in doubt. And that's going to equal Emerson's rate times one hour. So, um, I'm going to say RE, R sub E, times time. So, one, I guess. I don't know. That, is that too fancy? Plus... I know that rate times time is, is holes, so there's the first part of the holes. And then the second part of the holes is there's a second time uh, the, that Emerson works times the second time where they're both working, right? They're both working the second time. And when I add it all up, um, I get six holes. And, and notice that when I multiply by time, then the hours cancel. The hours on the bottom, you know, up here, the hours cancel, right? So no more hours, so just holes. Okay, so let's plug in some things. Uh, we're going to say um, the rate of Emerson is two holes uh, per three hours. And then it's going to be one hour, right? One hour, whatever. Plus, uh, the rate of Emerson, again, is 2 over 3. You get the idea, so I don't need to use the units anymore. Uh, times times T sub 2. Uh, plus 3 over 2 times T sub 2. Okay, so now let's see what we have. Uh, we have uh, 2 over 3, so we have 2 thirds of a whole. Plus... Um, Oh, it's common denominator time, right? So, let's see. Uh, times 2 on the bottom, right? Mm, where are we here? Times 2 on the bottom, times 2 on the top. Times 3 on the bottom, times 3 on the top. And we will say uh, 4 over 6 T2 plus 9 over 6 T2. Okay, so we can combine those now. 
and we will say six we assume that it's all about holes now uh, two-thirds plus we combine these and we get 13 over 6 T2 alright so I'm going to subtract my two-thirds from this side um, let's see if I wanted three if I wanted a common denominator I would say 18 minus 2 is 16 over 3 is equal to 6, 13 over 6 T2 you see this Okay, so I subtracted two-thirds from both sides, two-thirds from both sides. And now I want the T2 alone because I want to know, you know, how long will they work together to finish digging the six holes. That's the T2 that I'm finding. So I'm going to multiply by 6 over 13 on both sides. And uh, a little bit cancels. The 3 and the 6 cancel. This is an alternate ending from what I had before. 2 times 16 is 32 over 13 is equal to uh, the 6's cancel and 13's cancel and I have T2. So T2 is a little bit more than 2 hours. So I would say uh, 13 goes into 32 uh, twice and then how much is left over? About 6. So six and if we wanted to really get a sense of how long this is this is a fine answer I like improper fractions um, but that's how many hours 